For nearly 100 years, the American Heart Association has been fighting heart disease and stroke and helping families and communities thrive. Joining us today to talk about upcoming American Heart Month events, Lisa and Karen from the American Heart Association. Ladies, great to have Hi. you with us this morning. Thanks. Good to see you guys. Good to be here. Yes, so February is a big month for the American Heart Association. Tell us a little bit about that. So yeah, so February is Heart Month, mm -hmm. and this year our message is Be the Beat. Um, we want everyone to, we're challenging everyone to learn hands-only CPR. Mm -hmm. um, only about 46% of people who go into cardiac arrest receive hands-only CPR, and it's been shown that um, you can double or triple the chance of saving someone's life by learning it, so that's our challenge. We want people to learn it and um, mm -hmm. help us save lives. A, a, a blessing that was started off as what was a tragedy, of course, Damar Hamlin, mm -hmm. what happened to that kid up in Cincinnati and how CPR saved his yeah. life. What a wonderful message that is for the whole world that was watching that moment happen. To see how important it is, because they have credited it with really saving his yeah. life. Yeah, it was CPR. Seconds matter. Yeah, absolutely. Really. Yeah, so how can people, I mean, take part if they want to learn CPR? Can you guys help facilitate that? Yes, we So, definitely. at Commonwealth Credit Union, yeah. we have become very involved with the American Heart Asso Association because we believe that health is the first step to wealth. Right. And uh, on Friday, we are participating in Serve Day. So, 80 of our employees will be trained on hands-only CPR. And we also provided 45 um, boxes to companies in Lexington to also provide hands-only CPR. Yeah, how happy are you to team up with the American Heart Association for such a crucial um, initiative? It is um, our passion. Yeah. And um, we are also partnering with Baptist Health. They are actually performing the training for our employees um, on the hands-only CPR. Now, both these ladies are wearing red because National Red Wear Red Day is coming up. And, yep. and, and that message, if, if I understand, it's really targeting women because for a lot of women, they don't necessarily have the same symptoms that you think of the classic symptoms that a man has going into cardiac arrest. It could be anything for a woman, and, the, and it's the number one killer for women. Yes, it is the number one killer. And yes, this um, Friday is National Wear Red Day, so mm -hmm. we're wanting everyone to wear red. We want you to post on social media. Um, our hashtag Wear Red Day Kentucky. I know a lot of businesses across Kentucky are lighting up their buildings red. Um, I know the Capitol will, will be lit up red. We have a proclamation coming up um, this week. So it's all about, yes, raising awareness. Like you're exactly right mm -hmm. with women and um, knowing what those symptoms are and taking action. Also with the message around CPR, women are less likely to receive CPR than men just because of people feeling like you know, inappropriate touching or things mm -hmm. like that, but it's all about saving a life. So, mm -hmm. you know, you gotta be ready to jump in and, yeah. um, and continue that CPR message, so. Um, yeah, okay, and so Karen, you touched on Serve Day a little bit, but tell yes. us a little bit more about Central Kentucky Serve Day. So I can um, kind of touch on that. Because of their support of, of Commonwealth Credit Union, we have a Serve Day kit that's all around hands-only CPR. So yeah. if your company wants to put together an activity, it's all there for you. We have, um, you can think about doing it virtually. Do you want to do it in person? Mm -hmm. Also, um, we have, you know, invitations already put together, posters. We've got the presentation on hands-only CPR that you can teach your employees. The American Heart Association is happy to work with our healthcare friends, plus all the fire departments across Fayette County are going to be helping us go into companies that want to learn hands-only CPR. So, I mean, all the resources are there for you. Mm -hmm. It's just, we need people to take action and, um, and, and get, engage their employees, so. Yeah. Yeah, it's a great like, cause, and again, the American Heart Association doing such wonderful work. And who thought you could make everyone in big blue country wear red? <laughs> it's true. On one day, at least everybody can do it. You ladies look fantastic in your red. Thanks for coming out. We appreciate yeah. it. Good to see you. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Thank you so much. Stay with us. You're watching Good Day Kentucky. We'll be right back.